I just got back from work and I told myself, Julian, let's do a shield reaction and let's rest a bit. And I responded to myself, no way. We are reacting to more Attack on Titan music. We are doing it. So that's why today I'm reacting to Ashes on the Fire. My name is Julian. I am a professional musician and a studio guitar player. And today, well, you know what's coming. Thank you so much for the support. The previous video of Attack on Titan Suite studio performance was a crazy, crazy ride. And that's why I know that this is not going to be shield at all, but a crazy journey. But I'm ready. I'm ready. And I'm looking forward to it. Let's do this. Let's see. Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay. Oh my God. Yeah, I can definitely see the title. This is fire. This is absolutely fire. We have this crazy intro with these synthesizers and really crazy tones, timbres from the production team. They are really well thought. And they are still in the show. These synthetic effects, this. And now this kind of bubble like synthesizer also doing. With a pedal note in that last part. Really interesting and. It's funny how low on volume is this like probably a keyboard but if it's there it's for a reason but we may ignore it you know yeah yeah Da, 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 da. The epicness, the strings getting involved actually, and now the silence. It feels like floating on a large water body, you know. These notes kind of unsettling, not that much, but a little bit like mysterious you could say this anticipation effect hey okay I see it the main rhythmical motive is being developed and played by the brass section And we have two groups of strings complementing this with this and if you listen carefully it's the same melody with the same pedal note as the synthesizer I said in the beginning that crazy synthesizer But the brass is actually developing a little bit more the rhythmic pattern, you know? The brass is supporting the, the, that main melody only with some notes like like You see, it's actually supporting only the, the pedal note 
Interesting. Really interesting. Really interesting music here. Ah! Oh. That Titan is crazy, dude. Sympathizer with a low cut attack. Not doing the same melody, but it's similar because of the bell note, but they are different notes. Oh, and this and how the, the attack actually changed there. You see how they were tweaking a little bit? How is this possible to this? It's crazy! Wow, wow, wow! That first part of this main section, I was going to say that I'm scared, dude. I'm scared for my life. I actually felt the fear with this. This crazy section, dude! Listen, 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 here it comes. With a choir, I think, that it gives more dramatism and stuff. And the strings going all out there! Oh. The chills, man! But... Now it's getting kind of more epic. Pam, 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 pam. The choir went from scary to epic. And this single note from the piano looked so subtle, but coloring and showing us the, the harmony changes. Some kind of cello is this? We have three main instruments. Wow! Interplaying with each other. Now another voice. It's crazy! This composer is really, really... Wow! It's really, really crazy. Kota Yamamoto. Wow, this dude. Yeah, he's the, the, the synth player from the last video, right? Interesting. Interesting how he wow designates a, a role for each instrument in this part and how creative is he? Yeah? The, the, the strings kind of balance and and it's doubled now and the single notes from the piano, now the cello doing some counter melodies, lower melodies. Another, I don't, I'm not sure if they are strings doing kind of arpeggios and a, a, and the brass doing another sinister melody. The dun, to the dun, to the dee, which is a kind of cool wink to the first part of the chorus or main section that the choir were singing. The, 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 the to the dun. It's the same melody, but it's been used in this section. Interesting way to hold back that melody. But with a variation. And now we have the drums. Which seem to be kind of symphonic drums, but with electro filters over them. Oh, it's so sinister. It's kind of evil a little bit, but but 
Oh, the epicness, the tragedy, not not the tragedy part. The fear. I'm afraid, dude. This part is more hopeful, you see? It's more positive, you could say. Oh, yeah! You gotta be kidding me! What can you say about this? It's over? For the love of Jesus Christ, dude. Merry Christmas, by the way. Oh my fucking shit, dude. Wow, that... Can we talk about this part? It's crazy because you think that this is going to resolve, like, this climax... Yeah, this climax... It can end there, but we are left on the air with the suspense. And we are surprised again. They're playing with our minds. And in this part we have not that much of different melodies. Because I think the intention is is, is to play. Wow. With the high dynamics that are being developed. Um, on here, I'm speechless, I can't even speak. Always in these videos, I forgot how to speak because wow, oh, guys, this is amazing. This is, this, this is kind of similar, but different from Hiroyuki Sawano. Yamamoto surely knows how to, or surely knew how to keep working and developing upon the, the the work of Sawano, you know, for this fourth season. I'm just in season two, but wow, this is crazy, guys. Now I'm more and more hyped to keep watching Attack on Titan because of this. Maybe I'm just crazy because why is everything about this show so artistic and, and, and beautiful and sad and powerful and what the hell? This is Japanese madness, guys. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you. See ya.